Lily, thanks for joining us. We'll start by reflecting on the last couple of weekends, a win against Southampton and a draw against Sunderland. How have the team reflected on that period? Yeah, I think, like I said, we've had a, a good four points off the last few games. Um, started off not great and um, we knew that wasn't up to our standards and yeah I think the last few games we've kind of got into our stride a little bit more starting to kind of learn each other as players and playing together as a team and yeah the results are showing. And it feels like the team have really turned a corner how important is it that we continue to build on that in the coming weeks? Yeah it's massive um, this league I think every Sunday you never know who's going to win it's always a tough game it's always competitive whoever you play so I think it's really important that we go into each game believing that we can win we've done that v Southampton we've, we, we thought we should have won again v Sunderland um, so yeah we have to just keep that belief. And we're in the middle of a three game week now. How crucial is it that our squad depth is utilised in this time? Yeah, having probably the biggest squad in the league um, is coming in handy. Um, hopefully, like I said, be lots of rotation, fresh legs, um, lots of people hungry to, to make an impact and make a point um, for why they should start league games. And our Conti Cup group stage begins tomorrow night. How excited are you to get going in that competition? Yeah, it's always a good competition. I think um, always nice to test yourselves against um, opponents that are essentially in a, in a higher league than you and a, a better standard. Um, so it'll be good to see where we're at in terms of that because I think we've grown definitely a lot the last few weeks. So it'll be good to see where we're at. And Brighton are our opponents, and as you say, higher league opposition. Are the team relishing facing a WSL opponent? Yeah, I think so. I think, look, we knew heading probably into the start of the league that we, we should be up there come the end of the season we should be there or thereabouts and we've got a lot of talent in this team we've got a lot of um, you know really really good players so it'd be good to test ourselves against essentially WSL position and sort of see is there a gap what that gap looks like and so on And as someone who spent time working under Mel Phillips at London City what can we expect from her Brighton side? Um, you'll expect an organised team there'll be Probably very fit, working extremely hard. Um, they, well, what we played was three four three. Um, very aggressive in the press, very hard to break down, um, relentless off the ball, and very attacking. So I assume she'll have had time now to implement that with Brighton, and yeah, hopefully um, we can stop them. And just finally, a word on the supporters and how much they help and will help the team throughout the season at home. Yeah, I think the support is a massive, um, even Sunday. Obviously, it's a bit difficult at the minute with the new stands and being kind of at a higher level and so on. But we know that um, definitely after Christmas as well, that's going to change. And it'll be great to have everyone there and even people that wait after the game, that impact it has on us as players. And the support means a lot. And yeah, hopefully we can get some more wins for you. Thanks, Lily.